Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Okami. Last time, we drained the water in the place. In the main pool. And now we're chopping this, um, this imp, so he'll, he'll pull us down. Oh, dude, I, go down. Oh, dang, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, just go. Boop, 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 boop. Chop. <laughs> Look, our flowers float. Oh, goodness, I'm sorry. Oh, gosh, we're at the bottom. Hey, dude, dude, stop. Stop, there's a door. Oh, gosh, man. Imp. Yay! I guard the door here. Boy, I just love this job. Makes my it makes life worth living. I recently added a special mechanism to the door. Now it's really hard to open. The sight of people trying with all their might to open the door makes me laugh my head off. Hee <laughs> hee. Well, that's not very nice, Mr. Imp. But oh hey Jude! Man, he left me. That's sad. He didn't even notice I hopped off. He didn't wait for me. Well, this must be that tricky door. Look, it's got a bunch of eyeballs on it. That must not be good. Um, What's over here? Can I jump up this wall? Yes, I can. Oh, my. Dr. Oswald, you crazy person. Oh, it was a solar bone. I mean, it was, um... One of those foods that Amaratsu likes. A small holy bone. A holy bone that's small or a... Yeah. I didn't have time to do my thing where I keep reciting the th properties of a small holy bone to you. Um, I'm looking around for more treasure chests. Because we all like treasure, guys. Okay, I think to beat this tricky door, you gotta line all the eyeballs up. And chop across them. Uh, I got two. Darn it. Oh, I got two, and I got the, um, <laughs> the pillars in the background. Okay, I lined them up. I think I got it. Yeah, I got it. Ooh, and there's a thing in there. What is it? It was a big ice thing, I think. Ooh, come here, Ink. Oh, Ink. That wasn't cool. Ooh, it's a really big ice thing. That's cool looking. Huh? What's with this ice statue? No wonder it's so chilly in here. Sammy, this is no ordinary chill. It's kind of a creepy feeling. I bet there are monsters nearby. Better be careful. Oh, darn. There are monsters. Oh, it's a... Those look like ice lips. On a wheel. Yeah, this is a demon wheel. Demon wheels are crazy. <laughs> They're these big wheels with, like body parts on them like lips there's there's lip there's a lip there's an eye there's an ear and a nose each one stands for an element and they're all equally crazy i th actually think they're def like many of them are defeatable like by the other attributes from the other demon wheels like um this one this ice one this one um we could like to get its demon thing, I, I think you have to use fire on it. But we don't have fire. Actually, we're in a room filled with ice. There's, like, not fire anywhere. Except for, like, the letters on our on the, the sides. But we can't really summon the power of fire from those. Um, come on, demon wheel. Demon wheel, just try to hit me. Ouch, I wasn't being serious. Oh, goodness. See, they also like to waste your time if you don't have the right power-ups. <laughs> They're not very nice. Here, I'm just going to chop it in half. There we go. See, we don't get demon fangs for that because I didn't have the right technique, whatever. We need fire, I think. Oh, see, we didn't do the best because it wasted my time. Um, ooh, stuff's happening. Oh, uh, I see a bird statue in there. Oh, wow. It's like a, a rooster or a phoenix or something. And it's on fire. Cool. This phoenix is only a statue, right? It means, I mean, it might look like it might take off at any moment. Oh, looks like stars. Guess what that means. Brush technique. 
Awesome. That's a lot of stars for a cave. <laughs> Ooh, I see a bird. Probably a rooster or a phoenix. Oh, wow. I was, like, really amazing with those. <laughs> Spot on. Now, this guy is, like, one, my... I think this guy is probably my favorite brush god in the game. He is pretty awesome. I love him. He's pretty great. Just because he's this giant flying bird. His name's Mogami. Ha, huh, Amaratsu. Origin of all that is good and mother to us all. Sealed away by the dark forces, I have spent years in this cave. Time passed, but I was unable to make my way to freedom. But now, your power has lifted the curse that plagued me. I, Mogami, god of flames, lend you my fiery power. Burn it a new source of light into the obscuring darkness. Thank you, man. You're one of my favorites. Oh. We got a new brush technique. And this room's full of ice, but we get fire. Awesome. Wow, never expected to find a brush god here. We got a powerful ally just when we needed it. Mogami is the most fearsome of all the brush gods. Its technique, known as Inferno, reduces almost anything to ashes. Hmm, who should be our first victim? I know, that ice over there. Listen up, Ami. Inferno is based on the power of fire. You gotta place your brush on a source of fire and draw a line. The power of fire will, sur will surge into the line, creating an inferno. But actions speak louder than words, so try it out on that ice. Place your brush on that flaming statue and draw a line to the ice. I get it, Ishin. Thank you. Um, yes, this guy is my favorite. He's awesome. And actually, it's very lucky we got the fire thing in the ice cave, because I don't think we'd be able to open that door without him. You did it, you big furball. That's one hot technique. Uh, pun. <laughs> that was great, Ishin. High five. Even though you're sort of over there and I'm over here. It'll probably only singe a few scales off that orochi. But it'll make crispy critters out of that snake's underlings. Awesome. This guy's pretty amazing. Look at him. He's got his own flaming statue. It's pretty dang awesome. I wish I had a flaming statue. That, like, could summon the power of fire. <laughs> Um, I have the urge to do this. Oh, this guy. Hopefully he's not mean and he'll wait for me or take me back up. Hopefully he's the up elevator. If he's not an up elevator, we're sort of stuck. Ooh, a treasure chest. What'd we get? You obtained Infinity Stone. Ink Stone with limited source. Limitless source. Temporarily, temporarily enjoy infinite ink. Awesome. I can't believe I said temporary source. That would have like no it would be an infinity stone would have no would have no point if it just was temporary ink. It'd just be like what we already have. Whee! It's been so long since anyone stopped by. I was wondering the crank was going to rust from lack of use. Well, let's crank this thing on up. Whee! Thanks, man. See this guy is reliable. I can trust this guy to crank the elevator upwards. How much farther up? Okay, it's a while. Not really. Uh, is it a while? I don't know. But, I will see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Okami. Bye, guys.